There have been some minor disruptions uh, here at Heathrow. Uh, the management here tell us that things are running, but of course there is disruption. They spoke about contingency plans over the last few days. Uh, people who normally work in other parts of the airport are being drafted in today to ensure that things are running smoothly. You may be able to see just behind me there is a picket line here. Uh, this is just a group of people, one of many picket lines in this area, 1,400 uh, security staff who normally work inside Terminal 5 here at Heathrow. And as you mentioned, people are looking to get away for Easter in the next week or so. This is just the first of 10 days. Now, earlier I spoke to the regional representative of Unite Union in this area, Wayne, and this is what he had to say. Uh, we've been in paid talks with Heathrow Airport now for the last few months and unfortunately we've been able to find that, um, an agreement on pay that would match the current cost of living. So the company aren't moving, so we've been forced to take strike action. So just uh, explain to me what the deal is at the moment and what the preferred one would be. The deal for us at the moment has got to match the current cost of living being experienced by our members. RPI is currently around 13% and the company offered 10 In normal times, 10 might be acceptable, but... It's not acceptable at the moment. They fired and rehired their entire workforce during the pandemic. They cut their pay by up to 20% during the pandemic. You know, members have had a real terms pay cut by a quarter in the last few years. They just can't survive on the pay that they're getting now, and the company have got to do it. Some of them are on as little as £12 an hour, and then, you know, they just can't survive on that at the moment, and the money needs to go up. So Heathrow Airport themselves have accused the Union Unite of refusing the pay offer that they've been given. They're saying it's above inflation, 10% pay rise, backdated to the 1st of January, and of course a lump sum of 1150 Of course, this strike means there is going to be disruption. The advice is if you are travelling, please do check in advance and of course give yourself plenty of time uh, on your way here but Unite Union have said what the pay offer that they've been offered is simply not good enough. Security staff were paid around £30,000 and during the pandemic a lot of them were let go but then rehired uh, with less money and of course that is one message they are trying to, to point out today as they're here on the picket line for yeah. the rest of the day and of course uh, first of 10 days.